I'm Austin, Boston Rolling Product Specialist, and I'm going to show you some navigative things on the SY300 here. So when you turn on the SY300, you get to your main patch menu where you can see the name of the patch, right? So you want to edit the patch. You go into the synth effects menu, which will display your three oscillators, your four multi-effects banks, which uh, include reverbs and compressors, choruses and delays, and other such uh, regular effects. You have a return in through, which is a uh, which is a dry out, as well as a patch sub output, a system sub output, and a main sub output. So now a little shortcut that I found in this thing to get around a little quicker is let's say we are in a wave and pitch section in oscillator one, right? And instead of hitting exit, exit, scroll down, enter, enter, in order to get into the next oscillator, I can actually push and hold the select knob and turn. And now by doing that, I can scroll through all three of my oscillators in that one editable section. Uh, another little shortcut, let's say I'm in oscillator one, right, in the wave and pitch section, and I want to get to the low frequency oscillator or the filter and amplitude section. I hit both page buttons together, and it will allow me to scroll to the next submenu in that oscillator. So you can see here, I can scroll through all five of my sections. Tune in with me next time and I'll go over routing capabilities and some sound samples. Thanks a lot for watching. Take it easy.